good person. It's not the elephant either. The elephant broke up with me because I kept calling her an elephant. Man, even I'm jealous of myself. And I still don't know if I'm getting a refund. I'm not, aren't I? One day during quarantine, me and my girlfriend and be tranquil as shit. and in car rides she has this energy like yes we get to go somewhere i guess the parking lot was just practicing social distancing or something i don't know because some of you don't seem to mind that we're all real people behind the screen and it can be really damaging to our personal lives oh, 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 oh. well hi guys it's me the odd ones out now you might think that hey this guy sounds pretty different and i'm not I just ate some Vegemite. We would watch the wet, white, watery waves wash westward while wondering what weather we would want. What? Things are about to go down. Or rather, things are about to come up. And emotions and cleanliness are about to go down. But I wouldn't be making this video if the entire trip was smooth sailing minus dog vomit. We were out of napkins. But my unnamed GIF was determined to wash her puke-stained hands with the salt water of the Pacific Ocean. We drove back home empty-handed. Thankfully, I considered throwing the throw up bag at them, but after some debate we decided that we still might need the throw up bag. I don't think this day would have been salvageable if I had to catch that in my hands. We learned that this California girl has unforgettable motion sickness. It's undeniable. Do not lose hope, Biff, said my gif, for I shall find a closer spot within a jiff. For looking at my phone, you see, there is a beach within a mile or three. End of line. We're both in our flippy floppies, carrying our towels, sunscreen, and unbagged sandwiches, ready for a nice, relaxing day at the beach. I know that the internet likes their ships, but let me just say this once and for all. It's not okay if I'm into guys. Yes, I was holding that puppy in, in but now we're at our destination. And then we did what we in the business call give up. But I wouldn't be making this video if the entire trip was all smooth sailing. Maybe if we didn't pull over to clean up dog puke, we would have gotten there in time. Oh, it wasn't a beached whale or my ex-girlfriend. Unprompted dog regurgitation. But sometimes our most memorable trips are the ones we spend with people we love. And sometimes life's a beach. But there are lifeguards out, so off of YouTube. And as soon as we stepped out of the car, it was Floof 1's turn to wreak havoc and she dropped about half her body weight and poop onto a grass patch. Floof 2, there's not a happy ending to this story, we were both very upset. The good thing about Cali is that the whole edge is a beach, so we could do this all day. Speaking of crap, Floof 2 looked like crap. Floof gets very excited whenever she's wearing a leash. And clean up this dog vom like, ew dude. We're feeling... Lethargic. He ate our Sammies on a bench, near a beach, with our bitches. Ah! I wonder where we're going. <laughs> this sign won't stop me because I can't read! Both floops were sacked out from the day, even though they did literally nothing other than push bodily chunks out from both ends. 